Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and today I'm going to review the 4K Blu-ray edition of Guy Ritchie's Sherlock Holmes. If you're new to the channel, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification. You can also find me over Twitter, Instagram, and Letterboxd at MovieGuy365. Okay, Sherlock Holmes, directed by Guy Ritchie, starring Robert Downey Jr. and Jude Law, has come to 4K Blu-ray from Warner Brothers. Now, as far as the movie itself goes, I'm a fan of Guy Ritchie as a director, and I really appreciated his take on Sherlock Holmes and that whole mythology behind it. Um, I think it, it kind of modernized the characters a little bit. I know all the iterations do in some way put their own spin on it, and I really appreciated what they did here. Uh, I'm a fan of the movie. I think it, uh, it really just kind of showcases off London in that time period really well, even through the Guy Ritchie lens, um, but it's, it's a decent flick and it's absolutely worth checking out. Okay, so we're going to talk about the picture quality and the audio in just a moment, but first let's do a quick unboxing. Okay, we have the Sherlock Holmes 4K edition from Warner Brothers, and like uh, this one, also the sequel has kind of a matching cover to it, so that's you know, good to pair them up. Alright, so now we have the back and the spine. And then interior, nothing really special there, so standard. Alright, so let's talk about the picture quality and the audio. Sherlock Holmes has a 178 aspect ratio. It is an upscale 4K image and it supplies an HDR10 as far as the grading goes. Now, this being an upscale, I did some research looking at the filmmaking process and apparently a lot of this was shot on film but was also using a digital intermediate. So there is a little bit of mixture there between actual filmmaking and digital, but it does retain film grain, which for the most part is fairly consistent. Uh, it can look a little blotchy in a, a couple spots here and there, but you really have to be looking for it. Now, as far as the HDR10 goes, colors can be a little bit on the muted side. There's that little darker tones uh, throughout the film. Uh, everything looks good. Um, it has, uh, you know, that kind of, you know, Guy Ritchie style to it, and also a cinematographer added a lot of that uh, post-processing to the actual picture. So it renders the colors a little bit uh, darker in that area. Uh, black levels also look good. Uh, they're pretty consistent throughout the movie, fairly deep, uh, no real issues to speak of. Detail also looks fairly good. It's a nice uptick over the Blu-ray. Uh, costuming in particular, the old style London outfits look really good. And detail across the board with skin textures also is rendered really well. I, th I think for the most part, picture quality is very good on Sherlock Holmes for the 4K and worth checking out. For the audio presentation of Sherlock Holmes on 4K, we're given a DTS 5.1, and it's a bit of a shame we did not get an Atmos upgrade for this release. I think there are a lot of effects and moments in the film that would have really made great use of that immersive field, but DTS 5.1 is what we get here. Uh, for the most part, dialogue comes through the center channel, clean and clear, no issues to speak of in that area. The fronts, they handle a lot of the action, even the quieter moments are handled properly, uh, but when action kicks in, it does so with a bit of gusto. Uh, the rear speakers sound good. There's a bit of ambience sprinkled throughout, action moments, musical cues. It's, it's a fairly consistent use of the surround sound field. It sounds pretty good. And the LFE is moderately aggressive. Uh, nothing too heavy handed, but uh, it accents what's happening on screen fairly nicely. For the 4K picture quality of Sherlock Holmes, I'm gonna give this one a B plus. Despite it being an upscale, the HDR10 does really add quite a few things to the picture. The visual style from a Guy Ritchie film is very apparent here. For the 4K audio quality, I'm gonna give this one also a B plus. DTS 5.1 is very active, it's very strong, uh, and Atmos really would've put this one over. There's plenty of moments would've made use for it. So that is my review of Sherlock Holmes on 4K. Let me know in the comments section below if you plan to pick up the 4K edition or are you going to stick with the Blu-ray. In the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. Until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.